Yeah. Hello everyone and welcome to Torpedo League F2 Season 3 Round 13 here in Singapore. Uh, round 13 should have been two weeks ago uh, in Australia, but you know, things change. Um, and now with two rounds cancelled, Australia and Japan, we find ourselves here in Singapore for the penultimate round of the season. And today could be Championship Day, with Ancircos Ooh. having the ability to take the Championship. Uh, all they have to do is not be outscored by Scott by 10 points or more. Uh, so, uh, Ferrisin, sorry, I'm used to calling them their, their first names. Uh, so yeah, Ferrisin needs to outscore and so it goes by 10 points to stay in championship contention going into the final round of the season. Now, for it to end, that's step for it, the championship to end after this round as a total. For this, uh, for this uh, championship, uh, to be decided after this feature race, uh, Antokos will need to outscore Forever Sin by eight points. So oh, it's, I think, likely that Antokos will take the title after the sprint race. Uh, it really depends on how Forever Sin's race goes in the feature, on whether or not they will actually get to uh, keep the championship going into the sprint race. Last season, the championship was decided in the. Um, Singapore feature race. However, that season it was the final round of the season, uh, and there are only seven rounds compared to the 14 that this season will have. Um, so I'm just going to quickly sort out a couple things. Uh, today, I am once again not alone. Uh, like I have been for a lot of the races this season, I'm mixing up who I'm commentating with. It's been very fun to do and very interesting to hear a lot of uh, people in the commentary box, but this week, very exciting one, we have Yano, WP League F1 sure. race winner. Ah, oh, that sounds good. That <laughs> sounds good. <laughs> yeah. Video League F1 race winner is probably the most prestigious title I've ever gotten in my life. But <laughs> hello everyone, most of you will probably know me, as I guess from who is always watching the stream. Probably hello Kao and Manu. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, it should be good fun. Um, uh, so, we are preparing for what should be an exciting championship finale. I, I, it's, well, I, we think it's It's gonna be not finale. really the championship finale, we, but we it can be the, the end to the championship indeed, indeed. Hmm. It's the finale for the championship, but that isn't necessarily the case. Uh, so, it's down to this guy on screen, Forever Sin, who has decided to go straight on at this corner. It is uh, the first match point, shall we say. Yes, this, yeah, very good way, that is a great way of saying it. Got us from tennis. <laughs> Uh, I, no, I but it's, it's it's <laughs> yeah, it's first it's it's first match point for for mm. a while with slash and so it goes of course. Yes. Uh, so yeah, uh, other drivers that are sort of gonna could be contenders here. White Claw currently P1 at the moment. Uh, let's get up what everyone's tires are so that you can see. White Claw went on that that was uh, oh. on the soft tires. Yes, it was. Wow. Um, so actually, it's a really good lap. A really good lap. Genuinely, yes, like I mean, considering that they're currently top of the times. Uh, when... Yeah, considering the rest is like in the mid two minutes mm. <laughs> from their wet laps. Fair, yeah, they are on wet tires, so who knows? Which, which pro... Oh, 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 last oh, and our team, or our championship leader has spun. That sounds about right. <laughs> on on the wet tires. <laughs> uh, the question I have is, will Anzo goes crash it into the pit lane like they have done in a previous league when going out onto the wet tires for a qualifying session? I, I think around Singapore, so for definitely possible. Um, <laughs> True. Uh, yeah, the, the other track they did own was Brazil. Um, but yeah, but... my biggest question probably is after two weeks not racing, after one week deliberately, and the other week by accident because of this uh, game that sometimes yeah. decides to uh, mess up league racing, will we see a surprise somewhere? Well, will we see a driver that we haven't seen at the front any time of the year or any time of the season that's suddenly good after, I don't know, two, maybe two weeks of practicing for Singapore, who knows? I think. I mean, who knows as, what all of these guys have been... been doing in their time? Yeah, as it's been all. As, it's going to be the same as every race this season, really. Anyone can win it at the end of the day, but I would still sort of put my f f hopes all on so it goes, because no matter what this season, now they may not have the biggest championship lead, but they have just He's always, always there. been. They have been, I must say, one of the standout drivers. It's definitely my standout driver this season. I mean, obviously their championship leader, which sort of is a help on that scenario. I mean, pers personally, they, Bunny's just... always been there. I Bunny's another to... driver who's definitely been up there. But it's just, there's some drivers to me that just have been there every single race. And that, to me, really Agreed. shows sort of skill. Because there's some drivers that are here one week, not there the next. 
and that to me that you've got potential but perhaps you're not quite on the on your the maximum ma get not getting the maximum out of yourself i agree but i agree Absolute those bunnies they've just been and for Everson, another driver has been doing quite well this season. Yeah, and, it's, and especially Scott aka for Everson mm. and Bunnies have proven everyone wrong with their mm. shenanigans in, in, in the Premier League F1 sometimes. And mm. I've, I feel like they've proven most of us wrong with how they're doing currently in F2, grabbing yeah. podiums and, and so, sometimes even wins. Like, mm. it's, it's, it's impressive to see. And another great thing to well, see. Well, and so it is goes, it's still drifting team. through the steeds. <laughs> yes, uh, I mean, I was oh, surprised. A, a showman, a real showman. <laughs> A um, real showman. <laughs> Not showing any fear. <laughs> no. Uh, Imagine yeah. if he retires. Imagine. <laughs> yeah, my question is, is Cashin gonna dominate this qualifying session? I, I mean, mean, yeah, you've got us. Probably. I going for another lap. Oh no, are they pitting? Oh no, oh no, wait. My question is, did they miss the pit entry or did they deliberately do that? Did they drift it into the pit lane in style, I must say there, from Manso it goes. He does, the he does not seem nervous. He does not seem nervous. No, Anto guys knows that they've got that big gap. They know that at the end of the day they're probably going to take the championship today. Um, and if they don't take today, it's very unlikely. It's kind of a, it's it's kind of a Formula One situation currently in our league mm. as well. I mean, Eddie Eddie keeps his mind chill because he knows whatever happens, I'll probably get it anyway. It's just a matter of when. Mm. Same for us and the constructors. I mean, the chance is pretty big that we'll double the double the. Um, Double the championships uh, tomorrow evening, hopefully. Mm. I mean, Ferrari need to outscore us for like tw 20 points it is or something. I think 28 even. So yeah, but it's 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 good to see. Um, and so it goes drifting it around the streets, not showing any fear as of yet. And so it goes. You never I, know how. And so it goes to send the chat that of course their um, bad pit lane entrance wasn't. Are they going out again? Are they going out again on the wet tires? Of course. Uh, yeah. Um, Whilst we have this brief quiet spell in qualifying uh, session, uh, just sort one other quick thing out uh, before I do this. Give me a second, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, uh, sorry for the silence. <laughs> uh, just sorting out something on uh, the YouTube. So, um, uh, so yeah, let me just quickly check all the timing at this stage. Only drivers to have set lap times on the dry compound tyres. Uh, I don't know where I'm going on this. There we go. Um, oh, uh, well, actually, there's quite a few. That, okay, let's let's talk about the competitive lap times here. I'd say that's the top, perhaps the top six. Ducky's lap time doesn't quite seem competitive, as soon as it was set on the uh, super softs. Uh, but yeah, uh, current pick one is White Claw Steel. Uh, I was doing a very good job. Oh, wow, that's seven tenths ahead. Seven tenths up from the region track. boy from the um, super soft. It's wow. The super soft. Region boy's one of, it's been one of the best qualifiers this season. We're consistently being in mm -hmm. the top five. Yeah, I have to say, I know the super softs are wear out very quickly on this game in F2 car. So I have to say, the region boy got blocked on his first lap because he immediately went out for some for some mm -hmm. runs. So my guess is that this is the second lap, and maybe the tires are a bit worn. I don't, I don't know for sure, of uh, course. But I believe I set my pole time last happen. season, and that's not a casual sort of plug there. But uh, I think, yeah. I, 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 I think I got it on my second run on the tires. I think I'm not sure though. But of course, tires have changed since last season. Uh, currently, forever, it doesn't say it well enough on the, um, on the leaderboard because it still says he also on wet, but he's currently looks like on a flying lap on, on, on the soft tire. Uh, let's see what they will have. I don't know how pitch. serious that is, but. Uh, Ferrisen yet is indeed on the soft tires. Let's see what they can do. Speedy Carrot's going out on the set off. Is that already the ultra soft tire? Or oh, no, the super soft? Uh, let's see. I it's think very, it's the it's soft. Annoying. Because they've done the laps on the wet, so we have no idea what their sector times are like. Because they've gone 20, Ferrisen's just gone to 22 yep. seconds quicker in the first sector. Speedy Carrots looks to be going for really early actual qualifying when he's currently out on the super softs. Now starting his outlap. Uh, but yeah, let me just check the chat, see what everyone's saying. Not much at the moment, unless it's just not loaded. Uh, yeah, not much is going on in the chat at the moment. Uh, if the stream ever gets really laggy, guys, let me know and I'll just turn off my phone. Um, that usually helps. Um, Our I'll championship is still out on wet tyres. I mean, 
it, uh, that there oh. is the definition of some of the craziness this season. This is, but it's it's been amazing. This is the, this is the real practice, guys. Yes, Skip time trial. Get out on wets. Yeah. Real car control is what we see here. Uh, they're clearly preparing for something completely different. Uh, may maybe F3 cars if they ever come out. <laughs> um, because... Oh, and Dog Do are also out on um on the super soft currently. So it's Speedy Carrots still on his outlap, almost done with it. And Dogger on it on a, I, th I think on the genuine lap with a purple first sector, as Ooh. much as I can see. Uh, so he's absolutely he's absolutely going over for right now. Over some decent lap here goes up to four there, uh, up and with decent position. Uh, but yes, whilst we uh, well after that, uh, uh, is anyone coming up to the line at the moment? We can back no, Dogger Dog Dog is now turning going here old Singapore sling, so no, not currently. Okay, well whilst we've got this brief pause in the session. Uh, I have a quick uh, announcement to make uh, during qualifying because, well, let's face it, it's, it's a 30 minute session, we have a bit of spare time usually. Um, so, uh, a quick announcement for next season uh, is that I shall not be commentating on Topi League F2 next season, uh, which is really a, a shame for me. I just. It, I've. I had some of my best memories from league racing in this amazing league, in Tropea League F2. It was my first ever uh, racing league, uh, and found it on Instagram one day, joined, and... Well, I've been... I, I raced for the first two seasons, winning the championship in the second season. Um, and now, since then, I've been commentating on the league, which has been an absolute pleasure this season. And uh, after... Dogger, provisional poll. Wow, sorry to interrupt you. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, at the end of the season, after the Brazilian uh, races, after the Brazilian sprint race, sprint race, that'll be my final race as a Tropea League F2 commentator. Uh, this decision has been a hard one, I'll be honest. Uh, and I really am going to miss this league a lot, but I'll still be in Tropea League F1. I I'm not obviously leaving completely. As Ferguson has been disqualified for going the wrong way. Um, oh, fuck. And so it goes, may have just had a bit of a moment there, very happy with that. Um... Uh, yeah, it's a shame to see one of the uh, title contenders getting disqualified, that's not what you want. Uh, but yeah, so, uh, the Brazilian Sprint Race uh, will be my 55th, uh, 55th uh, Topi League F2 race that I'm involved in, whether driving or commentating. Um, so, that kind of fitting, being Jackson 55 F1, to end on my 55th, that's kind of fitting. Um, yeah, it's going to be a, sh a shame, and I'll definitely tune into these races as a, a spectator, watching on YouTube. Um, and hopefully all the great work that has been done by the league admins here, of course, and so it goes, and all the other Tropi League admins uh, doing fantastic job this season, uh, and I'm sure they'll do continue that great job going into next future seasons. Uh, and I'm very excited to see what happens in the future with more and more amazing Tropi League events. Uh, but yeah, so Tropi League F2, uh, I shall know to be the commentator next season. Uh, and we'll probably try and find someone new, uh, perhaps rotate the first commentator this season, we rotated the second commentators. And it's worked really well, I think, so perhaps we'll have the same with the first commentators next season, uh, which would be interesting. Um, but yeah, that, that's my quick announcement. Uh, if you don't... As, oh no, that's the, is, that the, is that the second oh, Dolga? No. Oh no. Sound the alarm, people. Second Dolga has entered the lobby. Trigger away the fastest first sector. Ooh, As good. our previous dominator in this league, uh, Kashin is now going on to yeah, her on board, first lap session. Uh, with her first lap here. As for Max Mulder. But he's currently doing some stuff. Oh, he's letting people through. I already thought <laughs> that he was facing the wrong way, but he's just letting people through on his outlap. Um, a Shadow Hunter is going on a lap as well. No, we invalidated. Shame. But yeah, Dogger's lab. I know you've been, if you've you've done an announcement in the meantime, but Dogger's lab seems very strong. Fifty-one five. Yeah, it, yeah, it's six times clear of white claw, but we don't. I mean, I mean that's about that's tires. about a tire gap, isn't it? Mm. Six, seven tenths or something. I think it's big around here. This is a track that very much is tire. Yeah, tire. true. Yeah, it's it's a very long track and very much tire wear. Um. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, the question is, it looked like it was a very good lap for White Claw, so it will be able to do the same lap, but then with more grip. Mm. Let's see what Cashin is able to Take do it so more time far. Looking pretty good so far. Ducky has lagged out, it appears. 
Uh, I will quickly invite them back. Sorry for the blue screen, everyone. Actually, yeah, it will give blue screen. Uh, is the game going to work? Yep. We start to pearl protect second sector. Yep, definitely. Hmm. Only a tenth up on Dolga is Cashin, so that is kind of close. Uh, there's Ducky. Um, in the right. Than I would have expected beforehand, to be fully honest. Yeah, but you know, maybe there's a mistake in there. Um, yeah, it depends which dog that is in P1. Is it real or fake? Uh, a shame that Real, because the mind. other dog is now in the. Ah, it's cashing and goes P1 in the car. by seven tenths of a second. Do you know who lied to us? Jeez. No, no, I didn't lie. Literally, you <laughs> put the race director. Uh, <laughs> but the fake, the, the fake dog is now in the car and car. Oh, well, that's just great. And I can confirm this is a fake dog. Uh, whoever you are... It is fake Dolga because the... Um, I, I like to be clean when commentating, but fake Dolga, if you would politely fuck off, that would be great. Yes. Um, fuck off, honestly. <laughs> um, yeah. I, As I there mean, it currently yeah. seems like three... Oh, uh, that looks very weird. Three Sauber Junior team cars seem to be go out at the exactly same time, but it was just a visual glitch, I think. <laughs> so that's yeah. our championship leader going out for his lap now. His genuine lap as he's on the super soft tire. Wow. Uh, Kashin has gone for another attempt here, so I'm gonna stick uh, with her, see what she does through the second attack, see if there was a mistake in there, perhaps not that. Let's see what happens through this sector of the lap. Seems to be a bit more aggressive on the power than the last lap, maybe just pushing that mm. extra bit out of the car, I, I would reckon. Uh. I mean, once you're seven, tap, seven taps ahead of P2, you can push She is quicker, she is quicker, she is quicker than that's wow. what. Uh, but yeah, let's see what they can do. Let's see what everyone can do in these final laps on, and final, lap, uh, final laps and final minutes of this session. It's been very interesting to see who is going to be able to take those top positions. It's, I, I, it's could be fascinating. Uh, as of course, this being. Uh, I mean, uh, I would say the best bit is still Cashin, but I mean, that's mm -hmm. no surprise, but. um... I mean, yeah, Cashin. Yeah, who, know, who knows what And so it goes, Canoon? I mean. Yeah, that's a good still point. Still, a couple of laps ago. Mm. As for Bunnies, as for Spirit XEU, as for Fake Dolger. <laughs> and Cashin. As she improves proves. with one and a half tenth. It's painful to see a driver dominating this much. But it's also kind of funny that a driver is getting polled by these huge margins. And i uh, clarify my last statement, haven't got pole position yet. Um, yet they're not in the title fight. I just find that funny. Um, yeah. She, uh, how, how late did she join? Like four or five races uh, in or something? She was reserve at the start of the season, but she didn't race like the first half of the season. She never sort of replied to any uh, like questions on whether any of the reserves can race. Uh, so she ne never got the opportunity until I think Monaco was her first uh, proper race back. Um, and she won there. Then the next race I think she did may have been Canada. She won there. Um, and lots of other races that she entered and won. Ooh, almost hit the wall. Ooh, that was very close. Mm. Although, Cashin. fun fact, I believe Cashin is still yet to get the double. Just fun fact. Is there actually that. any driver this season that has got the double? Uh, yes. Or maybe I'm even the triple. To possibly get a triple. <laughs> I do have a pole, pole position, I suppose, yeah. Pole um, position is also for more four points, it's not uh, nothing. I, I've never actually counted the triple, but in terms of the double, I can say yes. And so it goes, I've got the double so far this season. Very impressive. And um, she's currently up, and she's oh, only five thousandths of a second up her own best time. Yeah. Which is painful. If she can find more time in this final second, she's absolutely set. She, she, she can be a second up. <laughs> I don't want to drivers, as that's Max cutting in the corner. Not a good drive pick. Let's, let's go. As oh, another and the region boy there. around, and he is standing Ivan in the middle of the is. track. Ivan here on a lap, going through the hairpin now. As uh, lots of yellow flags in that se uh, second sector there. Uh, perhaps there's been some sort of incident. As there. I will keep on board with, and so it goes to see here some middle sector time. Of course, yeah. As it's currently purple in the second sector, apparently for Ivan. I'm not sure if I believe that. Second sector to. seems to be glitched sometimes, yes. so I don't know surely, but I don't want to <laughs> be, yeah. be mean about Ivan. Yeah, it's also for purple second for and so it goes. Yeah, so, oh, uh, you really Ivan. really believe that? Mm. Mm. Ivan here is still on a good lap, though. 1.2 seconds up, I think they it, were. It did look knee, quick. yes. It did look like a very knee lap from what I've seen, yeah. Yeah, as Ivan now 
into the final couple of corners, flying through these, well, in an F1 car, high-speed corners, in an F2 car, they're still very quick, but just uh, not that quick. As that's P3, that's a very strong lap there for Mivan. It's a very nice lap. That is very nice. That is yeah, five uh, times behind over. Contender there. And now we're seeing what Benson with Ghost can do. This will not be the lap. He th oh, he's going into the 52s. And it's P3. Or mid 51s. Wow, that's very close. The, the, to the, li the, li the line was a bit was a lot closer than I expected it to be. Mm. Was, I was watching on board and I thought the line was a bit later, so I was preparing myself for seeing into a mid-52, but a mid-51 is a very decent lap time. Yeah, let's see if they can approve their first sector here on their next lap. Ooh, he hits the wall slightly. Hit? Yeah, as... Very yeah. slightly, but I no wing damage as far as I can so see. I can, yeah, there's no uh, damage from my view No as well. wing damage, no. And he's one and a half tenths up his own time now. That would get them up into P2, so a front row Which start is eventually where he when wants to be, because well. he doesn't need to win, he just needs to back the championship at this point. Uh, Shadow Hunter gets out of his way. Any more people? More laps? Ivan is still on a lap. Norwegian boy, well, but Norwegian boy has, is still on, busy on the soft tire. Which is interesting. He's, he said his quickest, quickest lap on the super soft though. As Buller is on a lap, White Claw inv invalidated. Let's see. What I mean, White Claw is still yet to set a lap on down, super soft, isn't so. he? Uh, that is definitely a. Yeah, I, I think, believe so. Yeah. I, they are going to get one lap in after invalidating this one, so let's see what they can do. Uh, yeah, and Sonic seems briefly, to be slowing down a bit. Uh, very briefly, so those that missed the announcement. Um, uh, it was that uh, I will be stepping down as Tupi League F2 commentator at the end of the season after being involved in 55 Tupi League F2 races. Uh, yeah, uh, that was the announcement uh, for those that did miss it. White Claw here, what can they do in the first sector? Drive that looked very good on the soft compound tyres, but has not looked, well, they're yet to do a lap on the super soft, so. As they're no four purple, tenths up. Four tenths up, jeez. I'm not going to watch because they're very laggy and it's. Um, a bit hard to watch. Actually, they look a bit better now. If yeah, it's the, about glitch, again. It's, the, it's, it's the gearbox glitch. Oh, I haven't got that. Um, but yeah. Um, so yeah. As that, the car's just like steering down a straight in different directions. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> hopefully, it, it's able to. It's when it was going through the corners that it was unwatchable because it was just going straight and then. Suddenly it it, it looks all right from my perspective. Yeah, it's okay. But but, but if, but if he okay. keeps if if he keeps setting these second times, he could be challenging. Dare I say? Pole position. I mean, if he keeps finding five tenths every sector, mm, definitely possible. See, as they one are one point one second. Up, oh god. That would be a fifty-one point zero. That and means if he can find four more tenths, which should be possible, if he mm. keeps finding five tenths a sector. We're on board here. Let's see. I mean, this is a painful. Lot. As, was that a mistake there? It was hard to tell. Uh, it, it didn't really say. Yeah, no. It's like, it, it, oh, crash. it is a mistake. I see in the wall. I, I don't think they are. I don't think they he are. He's not in the ball. wall. They, he's they not in the wall. wall. It's just lag. It's just lag. <laughs> That's the thing. This is very. This is not good for a commentator. <laughs> yeah, this, this is why I said I don't really want to watch them. But here we go through the, the final fa corner. The fake over what can tired. White Claw get? It is and P2. It is oh, oh almost so position. close. Oh my so god. Close. White Claw very. Not quick able to here. find its final final five hundredths of a second. Mm. And now I'm going to watch much. anyone else, um, just because I don't want to watch Oh, and, and so it goes as invalidated, so no chance to uh, Buller better his lap than beat so Dilber. Buller here, driver going to the season. Uh, actually, Buller also got a double this season, I believe, in Bahrain. Oh, actually. Um, so yeah. Let's see what Buller does here. Uh, driver and race, <laughs> race in F1 and F2. What can Buller do through these final two corners? I'm not far, I don't know why I'm saying far in a few corners, they're barely halfway through the uh, lap. I, I was thinking, is my, is, my, is my broadcast behind or something? Because no, no, I'm, I'm just fine stupid. Too hard. <laughs> yeah. If I say something wrong, assume it's stupidity. Don't assume that you've got a problem on your end. Uh, Buller now, go through this split and his attempt down. Ah, that's not what he's going to want. He's quite far down the order compared to some of his previous qualifiers. To be fair, he's, he's had some awful qualifiers recently. Um, start the season as a championship contender. This season at one point had the top three card by like three points. And then, and so it goes, just drove into the distance. Um, <laughs> uh, that was just amazing. Um, okay, for the set, okay. Uh, repeat the announcement for the third time now. Um, uh, the announcement. So I'm not just doing this out of like 
Uh, it's because I'm getting asked in the comments. As Bonner is trying to avoid a slow car there, and is pitting. And he's going into the pit anyway. Um, yeah, so the announcement was that I'll be stepping down as Top League F2 commentator at the end of the season after being involved in 55 Top League F2 races, uh, either as a driver or a commentator. Uh, yeah, I took, I think, was it seven wins? or No, eight wins, two in my first season, six in my second. Dude, bearing in mind, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring these up as much as I can now. I've only got two more rounds left to bring them up. So yeah, eight wins, <laughs> one championship, and I must say an infinite amount of fun. Also a lot of not fun, but I would say more fun than not fun. <laughs> I don't want to be mean, but how many races were there in your season? Like thirty? Um, in seasons one and two, season uh, season one, uh, there was eight rounds. So that was 16 races, season 2, 14 rounds. So across the two seasons, 30 oh, races. Oh, so I thought like 32, I was like, only 8 wins in your championship season when there were 32 wins. Oh no, it was only 6 in the championship season. Uh, it was uh, 8 yeah. overall. Uh, but yeah. It was very so yes, it, it is, uh, the, 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 the pole position cup was maybe a bit less than I expected it to be. I was yeah. kind of expecting Kasia to just absolutely rip mm. off the field. This is like a two-way fight for the win. boy said his quickest lap on the soft subway was kind of right that his super soft lap was kind of messed up, but yeah. still, 1.4 seconds down. Mm. I mean, if we say seven temps in that, they could be in best of the rest of the NP3, which is weird to say best of the rest P3, yeah. but Kasia... And it's fair to say that, and so it goes exactly where it wants to be now. I mean, if he just keeps his nose out, nose out of trouble and just keeps it easy, championship will he be mm. his, probably. But if he spins, and forever in a good race, you never know what can happen. You never know. Yeah, it's very true. Um, yeah, this has been the longest will be League F2 season. Double, even with the with the two cancellations, it's double last season, which means in theory it's been double as hard for the drivers to do as well, because you've got double the races to screw up essentially. Well, that's how I look at race anyway. <laughs> Understandable, because you checks. <laughs> Although you have been very lucky. Yes. In F1 this season. Mm. Well, you know, you have to be there to capitalise on the luck. Like drivers like Perez in previous seasons has been like that kind of driver. But yeah, you have to be You're there the to Perez capitalise of on the luck. Yes. And I always am. I very much agree with that. Yes. But yeah, I, I must. I, I last couple of races I've been getting very lucky, but across the season in general, until sort of the final few races, I was sort of my luck was fairly balanced. But the last few races, I've literally avoided crashes by milliseconds, and it's taken out all the drivers that could have beaten me. So mm. it's yeah. <laughs> the definition of luck, basically. Yeah, basically. Yeah. So I don't hope we have lucky. a glitch lobby here. Uh, White Claw's glitched. So White Claw needs to leave and reach. Oh no, they're fixed. There we go. That's good to see. As we go to the formation lap now. Uh, Yano, would you like to run us through the grid order? Oh, yes, I will. So, we have Cushion and Paul. I think, is that expected? Very much yes so. Yeah. I mean... Well, less than a tenth gap is even probably less than I expected it to be going into qualifying. And second, White Claw, which surprisingly, seeing when I was driving on board with him on his lap, I would have expected him to get pulled because he was up by so much every sector. What was it, like six tenths a sector? Yeah. Uh, uh, four tenths. The real Dogger, ladies and gentlemen, the real one, not the fake one. The fake one is down in P19. Mm, but I must say, very impressive from him. <laughs> yeah, true. Fourth, and so it goes championship leader. Uh, possibly winning the championship today. Could I mean, it doesn't even have to go. It, it doesn't even have to go his way. It needs to go forever since way for Wouter not to win the championship. Um, in five, Ifan, which I think is a bit not seen it, but it's very, very impressive. Very similar to it, it is, is it, They're showing a lot of pace in these F2 cars. Yeah, he is. Oh, as we have a spinner. Who's the spinner? It's White Claw. <laughs> But oh. Ivan P5 on his first actual Torpedo League race after um, the first one got cancelled. Uh, Japan was his first one, correct? Yes. Then Norwegian boy qualified on softs, of course, now on super softs. Still impressive. I mean, mm. I, I, if, if you think of what he could have done on the super soft, he could have been mm. higher up. 7th, Buller. 8th, Ma Max Mulder. 9th, Timbet PGE, as my teammate in CWR. Uh, 10 spin and win, 11th Clint aka Trigger, 12 bunnies, I'm actually, I would have expected bunnies to be a bit higher up, but I know he's very good in the race as always. Yeah, so. bunnies this season is very much sort of a, a consistent qualifier into the midfield, but just puts in amazing drives, I must say. Like, both Bromers this season haven't been, you know, the spe spectacular qualifiers, but they're always... No, they, but they, you don't, you, you don't, you do don't have to be races. enough to, to win races. Mm, like, they, they do do that's, great that's, yeah. races. For example, Jake Marsh yesterday in CWRF2. 
I mean, you don't have to qualify it that well yeah. to win. I mean, just may maybe a tad of luck, but mm. lucky wins don't exist in racing, in my opinion. Mm. And Shadow Hunter in P14, Guy Shop in P15, Spirit X EU in P16, Team Lucky P17. Then the only man that can challenge, and so it goes in P18, after getting disqualified, mm -hmm. which is <laughs> not good at this first weekend yeah. to say the least. But I mean, let's see what he can do. Maybe you turn one pile up. Yeah. Maybe he's just lucky and has the race pace. You never know what's going to happen. It's F2 John. cars. That and then the fake Dover in P19. That absolute nightmare of a sprint race in Azerbaijan. Uh, not in Azerbaijan. In um, uh, in Vietnam. Uh, that he avoided that massive like six car pile up. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw those. Yes. That was just. Well, on which Eddie what said, could happen today. where you were going out of your mind, Eddie said, this is amazing! Yeah, <laughs> I, I was trying to be like, the calm, sort of like, this is, this is sort of... Alright, as the lights go on. Yes, lights are coming up now. Lights are going on. And it and is, it's actually not glitched in Singapore. Cash now's got a good start, but a great start from four wide oh, to turn so one. Four wide for all! White is, oh, yes! Over. Yeah, lag did that. Lag when white clock on, that. white clock on. As so, Ivan up to P3, even with a mega start, even with an absolute ball. mega start from Anna's P5. And has now lost a position or two. Uh, yes, and, and so it goes with a good start. Dogger also with a very good start now. As Fredersen has been caught uh, up in the incident uh, at the back of the pack. Fredersen was in the back of the pack incident and has got a severe collision penalty. So now biggest winners of the start is Speedy Carrots up by six places in two corners. As guy, as same as Guy Shop, as TRT Whiteclaw 15 positions down in Norwegian Boy 10. As Reversin indeed seems to be a bit messed up by the accident in the first couple of corners. By the way, correct me if I'm wrong, but this will be the longest feature race on the calendar. I believe so. I think. Uh, yeah, I mean, if, if, if you kind of count it, it will be around 34 minutes. Mm. Even without safety cars. I mean, yeah. how, how, how much slower are the race cars? Like, maybe two and a half seconds? Uh, yeah, a bit slower. Yeah, as we now, now are back to green flag racing, Cash and looks to have a good lead at the moment. It was 1.1 seconds already, one. that's a good restart, that's a very good restart. Yeah. And so it goes, it's a dogger his. Yeah, dogger his ass. Push up to the back of Cash and battling further down the order here. Uh, that's fake and dogger the question is, does and Ivan Ivan has no damage for his little tap on the wall, so Ivan is in, 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 a, in, in a very... Oh, as he spun! I jinxed Ivan. He's, he spun while I was talking about Ivan, and that's terrible. Oh, that's close. Oh, that was nearly oh a this is very there. close. Oh, all those guys going around him. Oh, Jeez. that was very close. Very close. But keep P14, which I think says a lot about that lap one there. Uh, still ahead of Forever Sin. Um, as that's another spin, that's Sky Shap into the barriers and spins it around and is now going to be on the racing line for Forever Sin and is out of the way. Uh, right the I think Forever Sin avoided it. Yep, yeah, they avoided it. No, that's all good. Uh, uh, yeah, Sky seems to be extending his lead. A hurly, bit by bit by bit. Mm. 1.4 seconds already going into lap two. Uh, but yeah, in um, I was gonna say, um, if Ferrisin does not score points and ignore the timing screen on this lap, guys. Um, but yeah, if uh, Ferrisin does not score points, which at the moment is looking like a possibility, it's looking uh, likely. All Anselm goes needs to do is to get P6 or Beth is to get P6, and they've got the championship. Um, if they get P7, then um, then it will go the way of um, Ferriston, and that will continue the championship fight into the sprint race here. Uh, and then pretty much all Antwerp going to need to do is not get destroyed by Ferriston, um, and their championship will be theirs. So, looking very likely for Enzo it goes, if not now, he will win it um, yeah. in the next one. And so Kashin seems like to pull away go. slightly, yeah. Kashin mm. is pulling away bit by bit by bit every second. I think so it goes, looks quicker than Dolga at this stage of the race. Uh, really pushing on the back. Two drivers Which is not for. surprising. Hunter and Frigga. Uh, both on, started on the soft compound tyres. So these two could be... Very interesting. Walk. As they will go longer and do the strat we've seen in the real F2 mm. plenty of times. Yes. Where they go longer and essentially suddenly come out way ahead. As uh, so what is that white claw spun again? And have been hit again. That's a terrible and start. And have been hit, I believe, by Ducky. That is not good. Not what I expected from him. I mean, with the mm. leg, it's it's understandable. But seeing he put in such a great qualifying result, almost mm. dethroning Cashin as the qualifying king, shall a mm. queen, shall I yes. say? I mean, can can we name her differently than the qualifying 
queen. I mean, she's been dominating qualifying. Yeah. That is very true. As whichever dog that yeah, is has to fake dog or fake dog. That's As I don't know if you picked up, even got a three second penalty. Well, he fought his way back up to P11 after being P14. Uh, after he spun, so. Look, looking pacey, to be honest. Looking mm -hmm. pacey. Atokas here is sure. Atokas and Dolga both showing a uh, good pace up in the fight P2 here. Uh, they're dropping back in Cashin, uh, but that's all expected. But and so it goes, and yeah, Dolga Cashin is pulling. Pull, it's not even pulling away that mega, it's just yeah. ever so slightly, bit by bit by bit. Uh, Bull is doing quite well in P4 at the moment. Uh, doing what they need just to sort of bang in the points. Keep doing it because he's already got his F1 seat secured for next season, if I'm correct. So, uh, well, it, it's not originally really... that was what it was, uh, but loads of things have changed recently. Uh, I believe Buller is confirmed next season, um, but there was, was some talk about that's your teammate or not. Turn, turn, turn. Who knows? I'm joking. I, genuinely, I don't, I genuinely don't know at this stage. I, I even I don't know who I'm teammates with next season. Um, I genuinely, yeah, I'm not, White Claw. White Claw definitely the biggest loser of the start because uh, even Claw uh, Forever Sin. Sin. White Claw is making a charge through this order here. Oh, he is, and Forever Sin is. It looks like it's kind of stuck behind Ivan at this point. I mean, he doesn't even seem that more pacey than Ivan currently. As there is now a very, very big gap from White Claw to Forever Sin. So, mm. I mean, we kind of now have this type of cycling front group, whereas there's one leader, three behind. Even As Forever Sin has overtaken Ivan. Oh, oh really? Forever has overtaken Ivan there for P11, so... Don't count the championship done just yet. Forever Sin is still making a charge up the order. And Seems like he has the race. fighting spirit still left. Mm. Yes, they Easter do. After, after his turn 1 next turn. Mm. Which he seemed to pick up no damage. Yeah, I'm guessing it was some sort of spin, or they were hit from behind, is my guess. Exactly. exactly. They did lose a lot of time, but they didn't lose any wing. And they did also pick up a severe... Which, which is a good thing. So... Who knows? They'll also serve yeah, exactly as we also said, Bunny's up into P7. I mean, <laughs> yeah, it just they appear and they just—he he is there. He he just appeared out of nowhere. It, it truly is amazing. Just the fact that you can—it just shows how good Bunny's racecraft is. Just to always be doing that, just making the way up the order, and qualify. Bunny's just demonstrating that you may have a bad qualifying session, but you can recover. Oh, that's a big crash, and is that Ivan? Yes, it is. Yeah, and it's in a big man, and safety car, virtual safety car has been deployed. I mean, I mean, it's understandable. Same for me, CWR. You, you, it's a big mm. learning curve. That's two cars. So I, car, I don't know. I nah, it's the Campos car, 100. <laughs> percent it's, it's, Yeah, it's the Campos car, indeed. <laughs> no, no, because I'm driving the Bocolacci car in uh, oh, okay. in CWR for two, so I'm not driving the Aitken car. As he gets another penalty for probably cutting the corner and yeah. running wide, you that, no that, grip. <laughs> and they oh, as he spins again. That... Yes, yeah, understandable. Oh, oh, don't oh, reverse yeah. the traffic, don't do it out on the F1 King, for those that know what Ivan, that means. Ivan is sensible, Ivan is sensible enough. Mm. So it's kind of fun to do, we have this very, very, very big front group of 11 cars all the way to Cushion, with, with small gaps in between, of course. And then it's an 11 second gap to like, I, I don't want to say back, oh, as it seems there is some chaos. It seems like there was so some goes, chaos, because uh, they were letting people through. Position to Buller. And Antokos is repassing. Uh, oh, what is going on here? It looks very, a bit of a drama very here weird. For P3. And so it goes to have some sort of problem. And Buller has got ahead. And so it goes now carrying damage, but doesn't. Go from from uh, the car. As Buller's in AI mode. Um, but from the body. Oh, yes, he, miss, he misses his left end plate. That would make me think that Buller is AI. Yeah, Buller is in AI two. mode. 100%. I can see the AI uh, symbol. What is going on here As with Buller? It would seem to me Gosh, that Buller again. is AI did the typical uh, under safety car thing where they overtake you. Uh, I had it with Faris and Monaco. He, he just, oh, they just overtake you on the safety car for absolutely no reason. Mm. Yeah, Buller, let's see. Uh, Buller's still in AI mode at this stage. And so it goes not far up the road, though. Uh, so I'm so good to have struggling a bit with that damage. Yeah. Still in a good position I mean, it, it, it is a big chunk, so mm. it would. Uh, yeah. In F2 cards, any sort of damage hurts like hell. You've already got barely any downforce, any less is, um, well, just painful. As this could be the move here, as Buller is back, but Max Muller is going for the move here, in to here, and Buller goes wide. Can they keep it on the track? They're not able to. They keep their nose in, they're going to try and hold off. Oh, Max that's, Muller some, here. that's some clean as defending. Oh, that's a retired. beautiful block. Oh. As all contact there, bit of contact there, rear to front. 
But that was some very nice MotoGP like block defending from yes. Bonner. That looked very nice. I could say it was NASCAR. Getting on the inside defending. and cover. Yeah, like, like, like going on the inside mm. and covering just, off the yeah, outside. Just, just sort of sliding yeah, the car into very their good line. Um, yeah. Another question is can Buller catch back up to, mm. to Wouter with, with, with the damage and so it goes hairs? Yes. That's the thing. Max Mold looks to be pushing perhaps a bit too hard here, going a bit deep into the hairpin. Who knows as what will happen. is also close to him as, as for Bunnies. Bunnies is still there, <laughs> as yeah, always. Yeah, Bunnies here on the back of this train, so... Uh, Shadowhunter has lost time. 3.8 seconds between them. The speedy character on a good race at the moment, up in P6. As oh, yeah, but they are both of the soft, yes. Yeah, Max Mulder is definitely pushing a bit too hard at the moment, I think. Uh, they keep going a bit deep into a lot of corners. I'll have to wait and see. My my biggest question is, will Cushion have a big enough gap to those soft runners to be a pit stop and be clear? I don't think so, and I uh, hope... Let's have a look at she, I, I kind of hope she gets stuck on behind mm. them, because that would make for a great race. Yeah, I think the gap is so small that she'll come out way behind them. Because remember, a single oh, pit behind stop the is a very long pit stop. Yeah, true, yeah. And not in terms of... Uh, not not just in terms of length and time in the pits, but also in terms of delta. Unlike Silverstone, which has a very long time in the pits, but actually quite a short delta, here it's a very long delta, so it could be up to about 30 second pit stops here. Uh, and that gap currently only at 17 seconds. And, that, and, and, then, and then you need, even need to add on the the, the, the time that make the uh, make the F2 pit stop even longer. The fact that they are simply here. slower than F1 pit stop. Bunnies and Speedy Carrots going wheel to wheel. Bunnies makes the Very good. Very Just, clean. Very simple. I mean, I mean, I mean it seems there. like Speedy Carrots was being sensible there mm -hmm. and just thinking, well, Bunny's quicker. I mean, could fight him, but would be bad for my race. Yeah, Since Shadowhunter is only three seconds behind. Mm. Uh, interesting, but a uh, no notable uh, note. Uh, I don't know where I'm going with that. A notable note uh, is that uh, Anzocus has a five second time penalty, uh, which oh. they will serve in their pit stop. And uh, that is according to Kyle in the chat. Which uh, is concerning. Works. Follows, because the with the death, yeah, the, the damage is hurting him loads. Yeah, especially, I mean, so you have to think, five second it. penalty wouldn't change, and normal pits would equal like 20 seconds in the box alone. Yeah. So 20 seconds in the box alone, then with the dragon would equal like a 40, 40, a 40 to a 45 second pit stop. Yeah. Which is it's massive. Be a tough one for him. That is days. massive. So changing their wing, that's what 10 seconds. The the yeah the extra. Yeah. Yeah, that yeah, that is at so, least he needs to change. That is at least two, three seconds that Bunny's losing here. They, they're I mean, losing he's about not... fifteen seconds compared to the drivers on the same strategy. On sort yeah. of like a, on that, like after everyone's pitted, and they do both pit. Yeah, they pit. Yeah, they pit. And now we'll see if he changes his wing, which I he will change his wing regardless. I think. As Buller there has, and Buller sped into the pits. Oh, I could see that one coming from a mile away. I was actually about to say. Uh, uh, sped down to the yes, wrong line. so it's good there's no waiting. The line, then accelerated again. Um, I mean, I can't go on board with him. That that sucks. Yeah. Oh Still yes, I see, I, see, I see them changing the wing. Yes, they are changing the wing. Uh, and Bullock will not serve the penalty in this pit stop because they obviously they got it on this pit. Oh yeah, zone. they're only changing the tyres now. Oh god, that's absolutely terrible for him. Where will Antonio oh, come on. out? Only exiting the box now. Oh, I only exiting the box. Ferrisin and the rest already ahead miles here. ahead. And Ferrisin has pitted. Although I don't think Ferrisen will be ahead, but it'll be, it's going to be close. Ferrisen has pitted, and to be coming out this close is insane. So this is going to be very close actually between these two. And oh. Ferrisen on the racetrack here. And look ah, how close yeah, that is. The championship two. Yeah. That this is that. This is what we want to see on track. Is these two out on a good scrap? Uh, Maybe it's not the closest, fight, but please we have a good scrap, guys. Come yeah. on. You may not be able to scrap it out that. in the championship fight, but at least do it for the on track, you know. It's a shame it's it. It's not. It's a shame it's not a winner takes all. Yeah. I love those situations. I but see. maybe this gives this gives Forever Spin the bit of fighting spirit he needs to continue it on. Yeah. You never know. Say, you never know. They'll, they'll probably take it to the sprint race now pretty easily because both of them look like they're only going to be in sort of. I think guys need to outscore. Um, Forever Sin by eight points in the feature race to uh, get the championship done in the feature race. Across the sprint, across the whole round, so feature and sprint, Forever Sin has to outscore, and so it goes. But at the moment, and so it goes is they yet to be score. champion. As things stand, yeah, they don't score, score any champion. points, and then so it goes scores only one point. Yeah, it, it's making Forever Sin's job harder. 
But these guys could end up battling for a first grip pole here, which I think is dying to know, as the leaders are now in the pit stops. Oh, yeah, Shadow so Hunter will take helpful. over the lead here. I think I think this will be very notable to how much time um that sword ghost has lost Dogger as we can he was sick to behind by going into the pit stop. Going into the pit lane, I have to say. Mm. As Bunnies is very oh Bunny still needs the box. I thought he was very close to Dogger there. So how much oh it's so much time. Oh my god. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> this is terrible for Enzo. Uh, we do have a battle time. for the lead, guys. As the trigger is on the back of Shadow Hunter. As they oh, don't go through second through penalty, multiple warnings. Wall. Trigger go for the move. No, they will not. Staying behind at this stage of the race. These two need to not fight if they want the strategy to work. Unless Trigger needs so, to pass to sort of gain the At pace. this point, if my calculations are correct, and so it goes, it's around. 13 seconds behind Dugger, which meant he lost like 7 to 8 seconds in the pit lane. Which is um, crazy if you think about it. Just a fun thing that could become important. Uh, once Shadow Hunter and Trigger pit, they almost likely fall. Uh, well, let's see, what was, what was the. Let's say the pit stops are 30 seconds. They will come out right around, and so it goes in front of Sin. Which means it will be a big battle for reverse grip pole. That's a big uh, reverse grip pole, and, the and they will have fresher tires. So this is gonna. I think this could be a very like. It, for example, if Ansovet goes doesn't get into the reverse grid, and Forever Sin does. I mean, e e even better is uh, let's see Forever Sin gets into the top three, and and so it goes doesn't get anywhere. I mean, he will start P9. Who knows? That I would think, be absolutely crazy. I think right now we have a legitimate chance, but how things have worked out at the moment, there is the We have a chance that Forever Sin can take it to the final race. Yeah, it is going to be interesting here. Which looked like an impossible task, mm. seeing how consistent Mr. And so it goes is. But in fact, and so it goes is pulling away, so you've got to imagine now it's going to have to take some contact for this to go the wrong way for Enzo it goes. Can we install a heart rate monitor next time, please? Yeah. Because I'm, I'm, I'm very curious, because and so it seems like Forever Sin is keeping up but maybe not mm. I mean, how big was the gap when it when he came out like 1.5 seconds it's or something growing. it's growing very slightly though mm. not by much not by much oh we saw him qualifying for since start 18th i know that wasn't on pace but still it, you know ferrison has missed out on quite i mean a bit if, of, it, uh, if, if, it, if it keeps like this will and so it goes be champion after the after after the future race after the future race no and so it goes to outscore ferrison by eight points in the future race oh yes to take the yes championship. Indeed, yeah uh, but needs to, uh, but Ferrisen needs to outscore ten oh, by ten points across the whole weekend to take the championship. Uh, meanwhile, Which they talk to a very if close. Things keep like this. As Trigger versus Shadowhunter here, could we see some battles going on here? I'm not watch on this battle. I mean, honestly, if they battle, they, they will like the whole thing where the strategy is based around Bill. Mm. As as what I said is gonna come true. Cashin has been catching up uh, quite a lot, so there will be. Quite this, this is going to be a three-way battle oh. here. This is going to be a three-way oh, battle for the lead. Oh, and last will, time will I saw Cashin a three-way battle mindful, involved with Cashin, or... we saw a three-way crash at the top of... Uh, but the question is, will Cashin use, his, use her brain and stay behind for a little and maybe lose those two three seconds, or will she go for it and absolutely just blast through? Well, you know, if she goes for it, she's going to either maintain her gap or she's going to lose her front end. Alternatively, that, that, if she that's stays not only behind, her. that's F2. <laughs> yeah, alternatively, if she stays behind, she's going to maintain her front wing, but she's going to lose the gap, as these two are getting very scrappy here. Oh, yeah, I, th I think they'll probably pit in next lap. It's my cr yeah, yeah, next lap, probably. I'm still, as Trigger goes oh, wide, that allows Trigger Cashin goes through. wide, and that Ooh. is exactly what Cash needed, and, and now she has DRS. Will she go or an attack into turn yes, one? And she will. That's incredibly one. aggressive. And she goes for it and she gets past. Could that give Trigger the opportunity no. to get past as well? Oh, we sent it. Oh, that's a bit silly from oh. Trigger then. That was a bit silly. Wing damage? No, no wing um, damage. I don't, think, <laughs> no. I don't think so. Uh, but that, that was a bit will of a silly move there from Trigger. Shadow Hunter go and try and come back at Cashin? Or, yeah, she's gone. She's gone. Mm. But that has given Shadow Hunter DRS. Very aggressive. Here. 
this may just hold off Shadow Hunter, help Shadow Hunter for one more lap here. Will Trigger send it to the inside line? Yes, oh, they will. It. Send it late on the break. Burke Rage was back there from Shadow Hunter. That has an epic switch back a there. Switch back. To try and go around that time. Now. But now Will's Will through here. Trigger's will there be any contact? Shadow Hunter gonna try and hold their nose in there. No, nope, nope, he does. Oh, send but he dives. It. Oh, oh. I thought it was gonna be contact there. But great racing there. That was there a rear. That, that was a rear tire against front wing work. Oh my yeah, god, that was that, close. That, that could have been a, a missing end play. Yeah. Yeah, that, that that most of the time that ends terribly wrong on F1 2020, but here they're very very lucky. Yeah, we could have just seen this uh, backwards trident coming out of that corner, but <laughs> they, they both kept it straight, and it, I'm glad to say that a great battle there from those two. I mean, fair the dive bombs are the best dive bombs, shall we say, huh? Yes, that they're not the sort of dive bombs I yes, go for. Yes, <laughs> His bottom is only, I think, what was the gap to D Dover? I think like 8 seconds at the start of the second stint. So Bottom mm. is catching up a bit, I think. I'm not fully sure, but... Mm. And so it goes here, or oh, starting to catch up to the back of Max. Uh, if Anto goes to get stuck behind Max, could that allow Forever Sin to get into the fight here? That's a possibility. I mean, he's only 2.8 seconds behind Oh, Max has oh, just oh, crashed! Oh. And, well, there's the answer. Uh, that, that was an intriguing I thought he was heading him through as a teammate, but on. then I just saw him slam into the wall. Yeah, and they're I was not like, teammates, because oh. Max and they are team. And so it goes oh, yeah, through. whoa, yeah, they, they, those cars Shut look so much it, like. Oh, my god. Thanks, <laughs> thanks for saying that. I, why, why do those cars look so much like each other under the lights of Singapore? It's absolutely crazy. Uh, it's like just the red and the dark blue looks like, looks like, looks like black, so. As Norwegian boy has crashed, As I Max, think? Oh, that nearly could have ended as virtual safety car has just come out. That means that anyone pitting like, oh, as staying, Max Mulder has out. come out. Just Max Mulder, I don't know why Max Mulder has done that, because that wasn't going to be a mandatory pit stop. Shadow Hunter, however, I, they were already in the pit lane, so they're okay. Shadow Hunter has gone very what, lucky. What has, he, Mulder, what has he done? He has stayed out. Max what? Mulder got confused there. They've seen the won't count as mandatory pit stop and thought that they were making a mandatory pit stop when they were not. Um, so... Oh yeah, of course, because you have to... Oh yeah. But, but they he has already made his mandatory pit stop, They've already right? pitted, uh, so they've already done their mandatory pit stop, so there was really no need for them to- and they're gonna crash now. And he's gonna crash out. And only they didn't wait till the virtual safety car had gone in, so now we don't get the chance to have a safety car. Which is controversial, I think, because is it allowed to crash out on-, on, uh, on no, we don't like that, but, you know. Uh, that'd be thrown to the stewards on whether they do anything about that. Indeed, indeed, indeed. And it hasn't really caused any other effect to- uh, True. Uh, Which is probably why it would probably end. Mm. Unscathed. As the, it seems like a two. Goes, are in the points now, and Trigger. Um, actually, Shadow Hunter. How Shadow Hunter's way off, I think. Actually. Uh, yeah. So I, I think these two are going to be on. These two could be the front row of your sprint race grid, which I must say will Indeed. be amazing. Actually, I think they might actually be one of them on the front row, one of them on the second I mean, row. I mean, around this track, the, the tie red runs will be absolutely huge on those warm and softs against mm. those super, super softs that are mostly oh. still fresh. Shadow Hunter will be the guy to watch then to see whether they do, in fact, use that extra grip. I mean, the trigger looks very clean but aggressive today, so who knows what he can do. Mm, yeah. And we'll, uh, here we get to see an idea of what the super softs uh, that are very uh, new compared to old softs do. How, Shadow Hunter how was quick behind it actually are. Trigger. And let's see what where the gap is when Trigger comes out of the pit lane. And White Claw has left the session. Um, based on their lag so far today, I'm not surprised. Could you really like them? Because well. I don't want to... Uh, take away the image for the viewers, if that's okay. Let's see, where will Trigger will come out? Did they... I think they may have changed his win, I'm not sure. They took their time. Trigger, gonna come out of the pit. Shadowhunter's gonna be way ahead. Shadowhunter here. Passes Trigger before Trigger's even got to the end of the pit lane. That's not gone Trigger's way, has it? Uh, so yeah, Shadow Hunter, is very Dolga, unfortunate well, the trigger. fake Dolga, is now in reverse grip hole. So, Which is not good. <laughs> yeah, that's very that's much a danger. Um, very much a danger. Although I have, I have to say I'm surprised that it's a not known guy jumping into the league. But he's mm. clean for some reason. Yeah. I mean, it's just very concerning and very confusing as well. I mean... Mm. Is there maybe a guy in the same house with another PlayStation driver or something? Because I'm, I'm confused. Most trolls who come into Bobby's crash everyone out yeah. or either beat everyone as to make them look silly. But this guy's just chilling out in P8 and reverse grid pull now, which is mm. interesting. 
Well, yeah, that, that's what they've done in all the ones they've been. The only one they caused, well, they caused a lot of drama in Spa, and they overtook everyone under safety car, and then took out the top three. Um, but, yeah, Dolga, the fake Dolga, is, well, basically, the, the way we find out who the fake Dolga is, is by, well, we can't technically find out who the hell this is. There's, there's no way we can do, do that. So the only way we can figure it out is who, the only way we can stop it is by figuring out who is inviting you. Because obviously the admin, the uh, like the uh, hosts aren't inviting them. Um, so, uh, hence today, every driver has had to record their screen, and if they fail to do so, they're disqualified from both races, so that they can prove that they didn't invite. Possibly, he's a, he can be friends with someone, and if the lobby is on friends only, he can join. I, I, by now, I think they would have caught on to that and made sure it was invite only, because true, uh, to make true. them record their screen. It's a very weird situation. Very weird situation. Mm. Is. Maybe it's not just a hoax and he doesn't exist. <laughs> what do you reckon it's an AR? No. I'm sure they have the basic helmet, but no, it is not an AI. Um, it's definitely not an AI. AIs aren't that quick. He's, he's way too quick to be an AI. Yeah. <laughs> That's the weird thing. As it's as it's has become a lonely race, as, mm. and so it goes, has been pulling away from forever. Seen every Funny, side, it's like... battling with speedy character. Sorry to interrupt, Yano, but there's action. And speedy character. Oh, finally, action! Position. Yes. On speedy carrot. Oh, oh, nearly going to the back of him there. To the outside line. They're going to go for a switch back here, surely. Or are they going to try and hang it around the outside? Oh, Good block no, there. No, 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 speedy carrot says, has it. What can bunnies do? Can they and, get And Soma's Ghost is catching as well. And so you will almost forget. And Soma's Ghost is still in here. Only 2.2 seconds behind now after those two battle. As I cheeky collide. saw Adrian put it into neutral for the extra rotation. <laughs> <laughs> not so good on the power delivery, though, is it? Nah, probably not. Probably watch way too much Tira, Tira Limitless. <coughs> so that is a good point. If <coughs> we, the big, I think the biggest, as Jake's pointing out here, the biggest mystery in the Dolga 16 scenario is the fact that both of them have the exact same PSM. Exactly. Now, maybe that's like I mean, that I mean, I mean, I mean there is this weird thing in, in this game where you can change names, but it's only possible on PC, I think, because they had that for the... Not a GP where Jimmy Broadband was called Jimmy Broadband and Lando Norris was called Lando Norris instead of weird usernames like we have, mm. like Jackson fifty five yeah. at one and Arv Rem Yarno GT mm. like. And speedy carrot, speedy one oh eight carrots, just another example. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, the one thing I can think of is that is there a, la a letter in there that is capitalised in one that isn't in the other? As Bunny's, I mean, I, that was a strange. Maybe speedy carrots broke too early for turn one, but. Bunny's absolutely all over the back of... Very the irritating, I have the ref, I have the ref limiter glitch on, <laughs> on, on Bunny's car. Go oh, I hate that glitch. And look back. <laughs> That's what I would do. Still not fixed. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the only way... Oh, I yeah, he's going, he's going, 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 he's going for it, he's going for it. He needs to get the move. Oh, very inside. aggressive Ooh. defending. That was a bit aggressive. Fair, fair, parents, fair, but but aggressive, fair bit aggressive. Yeah. Oh, that, as Bunny's got a three second penalty. I imagine Bunny's will be not happy with that, but... The, the thing is, the move but... itself wasn't a huge move, if you know what I mean. So sort of, it wasn't like a Indeed, big whack. Yeah. They were sort of they were moving to the right and then stayed straight. They sort of. Indeed. So it's very interesting now. As and so it goes, I think we, we completely missed it. It's absolutely on yeah. their tail now as well. On board and so it goes so this. this. This is the view you want. Yeah, that's exactly the view you want. As I think we can already safely say. I'm not gonna jinx it if Cashin keeps this on track. He has, she has won this race You're very much quite comfortably. Today, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I mean it's not every day you can, you can. I mean in the two leagues, I mean there are only two gamer girls overall. I mean Chloe from our from my own league FRL, as she's actually hit the wall. Is there damage? There's no damage. Okay. She's very lucky. Don't do she that. Don't was give part us hope. The... <laughs> the first lap car is about to be lapped. Team Ducky is being win, and. But I think they're all three in AI mode. Yeah, I think they are. Um, wait. Oh, all of them are. Oh, and so it's going to be a three second penalty. Uh, Kyle Larry just told us how fake Dolga has got the. They're not the same PSN. Can you figure out, without looking at the chat, can you figure out whilst I, I may have to commentate on this battle? Um, you, you have until the end of this Bonnie's Speedy Character Tokyo's battle to find out. What the difference is between Dolga 16 and Dolga 16? What is the difference in the names? Meanwhile, it's maybe they're in... a bit wide there. Oh, as in Sodgos is looking. 
think Antico is oh, trying to keep it off, so sort of keeping it out of line with all them. Alright, alright, all right, hear me out. This battle is either going to be the most amazing battle we will have this weekend, or it's going to completely turn to shit. Bonnie's going to the inside line. Speedy Carrots make the same late move. No, they won't. Bonnie's got the inside line. Speedy Carrots on the outside, and Toko is going to try and. Uh, so it goes straight to go the. Around on the inside! Oh, Speedy Carrots undercut. It's very, very uh, close. Back ruined there by Anso. Oh my god. Let's go. Oh, and so you can just see through that hairpin how slow and so it goes has to go in order to avoid and not hit Speedy Carrots and Bonnie's. It's. it's oh. He is so much overpaced at this point. Yeah. Yeah, and you can true. see just uh, Forever Sin reeling them in with like a tenth a corner at this point. <laughs> but yeah, about the Doga situation, I think... Um, um, I think they're not the same PSN, but possibly oh. like um, a, a weird emoji that this game doesn't pick up. Incorrect. Uh, it is actually... Uh, it is uh, a letter that is capitalized for one name and not for the other. Hint, the letter is not the same letter. So that in one name, it is D U. So this is real, real Dolga is capital D U. Oh, and one is of course a capital I. Oh my God! Of course, of course, yes. The other one not use an L. Use a capital I, which is identical in this game to an lower case. An L. Yes, yes, indeed. I should have thought of that. Seems to be very true, very true. I, I, I can't believe I didn't think of that. Um, yeah. Yeah, but it's it's such it's such an out of the box thing to think about. Tim that, that... left the session from P9. Tim oh Bettis wow! Left the session from P9. Could you reinvite them, please? Because that's going to give Shadow Hunter the position. Could trigger also capitalize on this. Let's see. Oh, Shadow Hunter make the dive into turn one. Oh, nearly hitting the back of the AI. The AI is break so early. I never go, when there's an hour in front of me, I'm never in line with it. Because I don't, I just don't trust them. So until it goes here, it's going to have an opportunity at Speedy Carrots. Going to the outside line. I think they actually closed their DRS there briefly. I was like, what is Antoko oh, doing? Uh, the Speedy Carrots is something. defending as a man. I have, to, I have to give him props for that. Timber is back. Antoko is trying to go around the outside. That's surely not going to work. Oh, oh yes, it really is. Close. Oh, that's what? a big story belt oversteer. Oh, no. I thought oh, that was one of the best moves I've ever seen then. This seems of a lack of grip. As Shadow Hunter, I, I am disappointed by how the Super Supernatural have been able to capitalize. I mean, Shadow they Hunter were, isn't the point. They were way back, though. They were like. I they were like way back in the. Back yes. Reverse grid. Yes. Um, but still, it's it's a shame. I, I would have yeah. loved to see him. As Dogger is still on, on course to get the fake Dogger this time. No, no, it's he's not still Dolger, on course to get. It's Dooiger. It's Dooiger. Definitely. All right, we will call him Dooger. 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 There we go. Dooger. Dooger. Now, Dooger 16. Dooger he's still 16. on course for his. <laughs> is, is it his maiden pole? Po I don't want to call it his maiden pole position because he's not even part of the league. But I'll call mm. it his maiden pole position. Yeah. I've, I've received his that. maiden fake pole position. Let's put it that way. As for every sin is still catching up, uh, the, the time gaps are gone for me now, but that's, it seems like he's catching up massively still, and so it goes in speedy carrots. Uh, yes, As Bunny has just checked out now. Issue. Bunny's up eight positions, eight positions into P4. I mean, exactly what we what we said has happened now. Yeah, yeah Skashin is still chilling out, probably making a cup of tea, doing her nails, who knows. Yeah. She chilling, probably. As uh, hopefully Jackson, can you ask Kyle to uh, shut up with the yeah. invites? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Kyle, I'm gonna ask you the very same thing that I asked fake. Well, I, that I asked Duga early in the session. Uh, would you politely fuck off? <laughs> uh, because <laughs> uh, I don't really. Uh, that, it makes a big. big oh, yellow flag! Yellow flag! Who has caused the yellow flag? That is White Claw. Someone, I believe. Unless uh... I'm sorry, if it isn't. Uh, no, it wasn't White it is not it, my, it was not White Spirit. Spirit. Spirit, my, my spirit, is spirit white yes. Claw. As Vidi Carrots and so it goes battling, and so it goes, it goes very wide though, as Bunnies is also just up the road. What's happened to Bunnies as Speedy Carrots turns in, and this battling is amazing. Kyle, I swear to God, stop. Kyle, stop! <laughs> We're trying to commentate, okay? <laughs> it's making a big black box. A big black as box. Forever Sin has catched up two and a half seconds in the last laps. If Forever Sin can get involved here, this could be interesting here. As Bonnie's is struggling, I mean, I mean, Bonnie's I mean, got any wing damage or something, because they're struggling now a lot. I, I, th I think yes, I think, no, he doesn't. That is a shock. I think it's just, I think it's right maybe on. just over overdriven the tires, maybe. Yeah, as look at, oh, and so it goes, sends it up the inside. That's opportunistic, that is opportunistic. Maybe right low moves. fuel, maybe low fuel or something. I don't know. Uh, yeah. As it, so it go, 
maybe even look at the like bunnies here. As for seen, it's now only 1.6 seconds behind. It only takes a minor mistake of any of them for them to get reeled in by Forever Sin. All it takes is a, a dive bomb going As wrong. Cashin, of course, I mean, we, we didn't even cover there when she goes to line. She wins the Singapore feature race with a 16 second gap amazing. to beat the Dogger, who has been amazingly quiet, but amazingly yeah. chill as well. Dogged no that. mistakes. An outstanding result there. Very um, good. As Buller like takes... Ma I wouldn't call it lucky, because he has been there, but it is... Yeah, so it goes was unlucky, but the but the Buller Speedy Carrots had a problem. Podium. Speedy Carrots run out of fuel. Oh god, no! Oh my god, and it's Forever Sin up to P6. So Bunny is mega. D4. Forever Sin, oh, Forever Forever Sin P5! On oh, that makes his job a hell of a lot diff more difficult. As, as Fake oh, as has glitched Dolger. their way up. As Into P2, Uga. as it's a... But I think from Codemasters then a uh, Carlin one two. What the <laughs> hell was that? I've never seen a glitch of that like that. So provisional race results: Cashin P one, uh, real Dogger P two, outstanding drive. Buller P four, capitalizing of others' mistakes and just pretty clean, I must say. Bunny's P four after, I think, a very outstanding drive. Forever seen coming back from a terrible first corner and a terrible qualifying session, coming down, coming home in P five in the end. With Speedy Carrots, his fuel problem. <laughs> yeah, Speedy that was an exciting end to the race. It, it needed some time to warm up, but it is here. That was a truly epic ending. As the fake Dolger, Dooger, Dooger, Dooger has taken sprint race pole position. I mean, as long as the game doesn't really recognize him in P2. Is the, he on the, the podium? No, the game does recognize him in P2. The game is him on the po sets him on yeah, the podium, is, which is very much not the true race results. So but that's kind of cursed for his results fair, for the, the sprint race is, then. Is, is, yeah, but they, they're not in the league, so their results don't matter anyway. So True. But that's kind of way his, his, his moment of glory, even though he's not in the league. Yeah. Uh... So, uh, I'm probably a great for this race. 6.5 out of 10. Mm. Am I a bit too harsh here? Um, I'd say that's a pretty mediocre race. Not a good, not, not a lot of fight on the front, but Cashin has just been outstanding today. I mean, apparently to the game, their best laptop was a 53.5, which I very much doubt. Oh no, it's just Dogger being very quick. Wow. Apparently, um, the game recognized us as 35.1. I've seen a glitch like this before, Very where it gives the guy, if, if you join mid-session, you get the lead. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, this it's is very a weird. sort of timing glitch. Um, but yeah, but yeah uh, interesting, in, is, interesting uh, race ahead. Interesting, interesting race ahead. One has a capital L. Uh, one has an L, the other has a capital I. So there is a difference in the PSN. They are not... Uh, the, the two guys fighting for Chip will be second and third on the grid. That is exciting. Uh, I I smell controversy coming up. <laughs> so I can't. But with how much uh, with how much uh, points did goes, is yet to win the championship? With how much points did Forever Sin outscore? Um, I believe Walter it was race? by two points. So Wouter needs to outscore and Forever Sin by twelve points now, which is a race win essentially, or second place. I uh, know. So, um, and so it goes, doesn't need to outscore Forever Sin. Forever Sin needs to outscore, and so it goes, uh, by eight points now. Oh, yeah, 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 indeed. Oh, yes, yes, because it was the sprint race, of course, yes. Yes. She says, that's going to be very interesting. Will he make it, or will he, or won't he make it? Uh, that, that's the question. Yeah. I mean, I think... Yeah, for Everson, I don't know how he did it, but... Those last two... I mean, being clean on the penalties, you see, it helps... Kyle, stop. Massively. Kyle, stop. I'm going to ask anyway. you again to politely fuck off. So, and so it goes after Fake Dog is sent to another dimension on the race results chart. So, if we ignore <laughs> Duga's result, that means that, and so it goes, got P6, which is 8 points, and Ferrisin got P5, which is uh, 10 points. So, yeah, Ferrisin needs to outscore, and so it goes in this race by 8 points to stay in championship contention, which I think is possible. So, uh, Yano, would you like to run us through the grid for this race? As always. So, Speedy Carrots on pole, which should have been the fake Dooger, as we call him. Mm -hmm. But, game decided to glitch, and I'm not unhappy with that, to be honest. So, now we genuinely have a driver of the league on pole position. And so, it goes second after taking Forever Sin's places. 
Uh, um, after the race, so penalties. I don't know what I just saw, but, um... <laughs> As we have champion, no, not a, no championship leader in second. Uh, will he? The question is, will he take? Will he take it? Mm. I think it's looking more Forever like. in third. It, it's more likely that they will than mine. But we'll have to wait and see. True. Forever in third. Bunnies in fourth. Are a very, 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 very good feature race from him. I mean, will he be able to take the podium? I genuinely hope so. He would deserve it after that mm. feature race. Buller in fifth. Uh, real dog. Yeah. Uh, Arn is a real dogger, real dogger in P6, fake dogger in P7, or as we call him, Duger in P7, race winner from the last race, Cashin in P8, Tim Betch, Tim Bet, yeah, I'm just gonna say Tim in P9, uh, is he still AI mode? I don't think so, right? Um, I can't see. He has joined the session back, I think. Uh, Shadowhunter P10, yeah, Trigger P11, Spirit X, Spirit P12, Spin and Win P13. Team Ducky P14, White Claw P15, as they all, yeah, I think Spin and Win Team Ducky, TRT White uh, Claw. Uh, uh oh. Yeah. So it's probably gotta cause some crashing. Uh, no, uh, as I think. Uh, as I think, if I'm correct, Spin and Win Team Ducky, TRT White Claw, and Ivan are all four on AI mode, which is gonna cause for some crashes, I think. Mm, we will we'll need to see. see. Um, but yeah. Um, which, who do you think is going to win? Any uh, predictions? I would say. Do you, do you, do you have the balls to predict a Formula 2 race? That's the question. Goes. Starting P2. A speedy character will definitely take the flight for them, but we saw in the. Um, we saw in the features. He, 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 he's he's, he's defending too. with his nuts. He's defending with massive balls. Yeah, that's true. So, if speedy character gets the lead here into turn, what will maintain Not, go, not going to be easy. Not going to be easy no. at all. Let's see what happens. I think prepared. bunnies would also look very strong if any of the three guys in front. You saw it in the feature race, he can capitalize on the mistakes. So that's one. It's possible. It is definitely possible. Everything is possible. As the lights hopefully go on every time. <laughs> any time now. You may have a glitch. I hope we have a glitch because you can't do a feature race again, and it would be a very anticlimactic end. Yeah. <sighs> I will wait. News. Oh no. Let's wait and see what happens. Apparently Trigger uh, is the issue at the moment. Uh, Tim and uh, Trigger need to leave apparently. As, t as note, the game has crashed and the broadcast has died.